I think many of us can agree that volunteering is an important and good thing in our community. But I wanted to ask you a question. How much of it have you done in the last year? If it's so important for us to give back, then why do so few of us do it? My name is Jonathan Gunter, and over the last seven years, I have volunteered with many nonprofits, including one that me and my own family have, uh, have founded, Living Bridges Ministry. And I want to talk to you today about why volunteering is so important. My three points I want to bring up today are at first going to sound fairly similar, but in the end, I think that you'll see that they're pretty different. I wanted to talk to you first of all about why volunteering is good for the people that you are directly helping, why it's good for your community, and finally, why it's good for you. Now, let's get started. First, I wanted to ask why uh, it's good for the people you help. And I feel like this is the most obvious point I could possibly make. Uh, we've all had moments where we've needed help, and that's just what volunteering is. We've uh, It could be something like we had with Irma last year, where maybe you've lo uh, your home was damaged, or you lost something important, such as maybe your car. Or it could be as simple as you don't have enough money to eat. Well, that sounds simple, but it's still very obviously important that you need to eat. That's just what volunteering for is. We have Habitat for Humanity, which helps construct houses that uh, for more affordable rent, and we have things like soup kitchens for things uh, for, for people who can't afford to eat. It could, uh, and any of those, not only can they help you, but you can help at them with almost no required skills. Any person can help at a soup kitchen, and it's super simple. And almost anybody can help out with something like building a house for Habitat. All you need is time. Now, obviously, I'm not saying that everyone can do it 24-7. Obviously, you got to go make your own money. But giving back to other people, even when it helps and if uh, something happens, it can help you too. Why it's good for the community. Volunteering has been shown to help increase communities' health and wealth. The, uh, it also increases the trust and bonding between communities. Is You don't know necessarily, you may know your neighbors, but you don't 100% know what's going on in their lives. For all you know is three houses down the street from you, is the family there can't afford to eat. Is Maybe they look fine on the outside, but it could be just be falling apart on the inside and they're just trying to keep up appearances. This volunteering can help build a more trusting bond and help them not only help them out through this hard time, but if you, once again, if you ever end up in a hard time, they may return the favor and it just brings the whole community closer together. And this togetherness helps drive out things such as hatred and can help slow down is I'm sure you've seen it too, is things such as violence in neighborhoods have grown over the last few years, but it's been shown that more uh, that more uh, that communities with a closer bond tend to have a slower time or even reverse said process. Finally, I wanted to talk about why it's good for you. It has actually been shown that volunteering is very good for your health in both mental and physical. It can help boost your self-confidence, Raise your happiness, which as we talked about in my last speech, is very good for things such as depression, heart attacks, and can even boost your lifespan. And it also helps uh, boost your career by helping because several companies do look over your resume and look for things such as volunteers just to see extra skills. That's how I got my job at Wild Adventures is I hadn't had a job before that, but I had volunteered a lot and they looked over my skills and they thought, hey, this actually looks pretty good. In the end, once again, as it seems obvious at first, but volunteering really is one of the best things you can do. It helps everybody. It helps others. It helps the community as a whole. And it can even help you. Well, once again, I know it's obvious that not everyone can volunteer all the time, but it is important to give back every once in a while. It doesn't have to take, it doesn't have to be a big thing to uh, help bring the community closer together. Just look around next time you have a little bit of free time and see what you can do. Heck, even cleaning up some litter or donating a little bit of money to some charities can help make a big difference. Well, I think that's just about all I got for today, so I hope you enjoyed the video, and have a great day.